Hello, can you hear me now? Yes, yes. This is Alan Marshall from PayPal, remember? Hey, hi, Alan. Yeah, my phone freaking broken, so uh, I don't know what's going on with my All phone. All right, so are you Mr. Candle, right? Who? Are you Mr. Daryl Candle? No, no, I, was, I, I had a call off James. James yeah. told me to call him back on this number. Oh, yes, 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 I remember. Now, are you sitting next to your computer, sir? Uh, yes, I am, James, yeah. Uh, all right, all right. So, you do one thing, sir, you just pull up your Google Chrome, okay? Okay. Uh, Google Chrome. And if you don't mind, sir, uh, all right, so if you don't mind, like, can I know that? How old are you? I'm um, 41. 41, all right. Yeah, my Google's open. All right, you go, you open up the Google Chrome, right? Did you play that Amazon, that order from the Amazon? No. No, no problem. And you didn't share any information to anyone else, right? Yeah, right, no. Write down my name. My name is... All right, so, uh, I do believe that your Google Chrome is open up, right? Yeah, it's open, uh, yeah. Click on allow, please. Look All at right, your you know you do one computer. thing. Look at the top of the screen. Can you see a long address panel? Uh, yes. Now you need to type over there. Amazon support. No, All one word? Yes. Yes, all in one word. Amazon support. Yeah. Is that it? The number 10. One, then after that. Type the number 10. Number one. 1, number 0. Okay. Yeah, Amazon support 10. Okay. Then give a dot like a period. Okay. And after that, type the letter W as in whiskey. Okay. And after that, type the letter E as in echo. Okay. Then let it once again E as an echo. Okay. Okay. Then let it be as in boy, Brandon. Yeah. Then let it L as in London. L. Yeah. Then let it Y as in yellow. Now look at your Y as in yellow. Okay. Yeah. Then give a dot like a period. Dot. Uh huh. And after that, yeah. type the letter com. C O M. Com. C O M. Okay. M. Com. Yeah. Support Amazon support ten dot weebly dot com. Correct. Yeah. All right. Now you press your enter button from your keyboard. Press enter. Sir. Okay. Oh, Amazon dot com home. Track your order. Amazon. Um, now, can you see cancel your order Amazon in a big word? Uh, yeah. All right. Can you see track your order over there? Uh, tra yeah, track your order. Yeah. Yeah, click on that. Click on track your order. Okay. Amazon yeah, will just check your order. Right, you just write, write down your name. Email and you just click on check, and after that, you will get the information about this product. Uh, okay, uh, gmail.com. Uh, and then just check. Hello? Yeah. Now, did you click on check? Uh, I have now your order details. 
Um, yes. Now, what is the order? Can you confirm me that, sir? Uh, your order details, your order will be sent to name Kevin uh, Metnick. Email Kevin oh. Metnick 24. Um, yes, exactly. Exactly. Uh, 242 Mountain View Ave Zip. For $399.99, model iPhone 11. Can you hear me? Yeah, can I can, hear me? yeah, I can hear you now. You just, it, I couldn't hear before. Uh, all right, now you don't know about this guy who is placing this order. This no, is the guy. I don't know, Kevin. No. We just compromise you. You don't know. So, simply what we are going to do, because there is a fake Amazon account which is still running from your computer, sir. So. So that reason we're gonna connect you in our Amazon secure server, okay. and after that, and after that we're gonna generate you a cancellation form for you. Okay. Oh, okay. So you yeah. Do one thing, go back to the previous page. Yeah, go back to the previous page. And for what purpose you use a computer? Sir? Yeah, just shopping, banking, and yeah, just general stuff. Uh huh. No problem. Now you do one thing. Go back to the previous page of home screen of Amazon. Cancel your order. Uh, okay. Cancel your order. Uh, how to do that? Yeah. Previous page. All oh, right. Yeah. You just oh, look on the tab. All right. Now you got that. You need to go and log in. All right. Now scroll down your page. Scroll down. Uh, yeah. Logging your bank. You now, can you see cancel your order for Windows number one? Is this your Windows computer? I do believe, right? Yeah, yeah. Uh, All right, cancel your order number one at the very bottom. Just scroll down your page. All right. Can you hear me? Oh, yeah, okay. Cancel your order number one, yeah? Yeah, double click on that. I mean, you write that. You need to log in your. Uh, and after that, what comes now? What comes up on your screen? Uh, team viewer. Team viewer. Now look at the bottom. Don't need to scroll down your page. Just look at the bottom, on the left hand side. Can you see over there? Team viewer setup exe. Yeah. Now double click that, and you need to open up that file. Okay. Yeah. Uh, it says, how do you want to proceed? Yeah. Uh, default installation, the first default installations, and uh, look at the underneath. Can you see continue except? Yeah. Except run. Click on that. Do you want to allow this app to make changes to your device? Yes. Y yes. 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 Okay. You need to your bank account with this device. Now afterwards, what do you see? You just let me know that, okay? Notify me. Okay. Yeah. Uh, it says remote control, manage remote meetings, con your ID, password. All right, now confirm me the ID number slowly, slowly. Uh, the ID number is... Mm -hmm. 725, right? Oh my goodness, tell me from the beginning. One by one, slowly, slowly. Yes. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. And tell me the password slowly, slowly, one by one. Uh-huh. 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 Correct, yeah. All right, now you don't touch your computer, sir, please. You will be getting connected to our 
Amazon secure server so we can deactivate. Once you will be getting connected, so can, can you just confirm me the team viewer, like the team viewer ID number? And, uh, yeah. Uh, what, sir? Tell me from the beginning. Yes. Uh huh. After that, two. All right, got it. Give me a moment, sir. Okay. Yeah. And you, uh, like you haven't shared any information to anyone else, right, sir? You're right. No problem. Because this guy, Kevin Mitnick, they just get inside your IP address and try to steal your information, sir, with the help of your computer IP. Whenever you try to go online, you go online sometimes, right, sir? Yeah. Ah, oh, no problem. Can you, you, uh, you do online banking in this computer sometimes? Yeah. Uh, this is the reason, sir. They just compromise your financial details with the help of your information. Now you are successfully connected, sir. Uh, give me a moment. Okay. Yeah. Give me a moment. Now, when you when you see the Amazon refund form, just notify me, okay? Okay. Yeah. Now, first of all, you look over here. What is it? What is written, sir? Uh, secu uh, connection is secure. Oh, now, yes. you understand what it's been, right? Yeah. Oh, okay. Now, do you see the cancellation form of Amazon, the refund form? Yeah. Cancellation <laughs> form from Amazon.com. Yeah. Yes, yes. Now you see, what do you see over here? Uh, connection is secure. Yes, because you are successfully secure with the Amazon server right now. Now you just fill up the form by your side and you don't need to tell me any information over the phone because this call is federally recorded as for your quality and training purpose, okay? okay. Now you do one thing, fill up each and everything by your name. Okay. But if you face any problem, Mr. James, then ask me, okay? Okay. Oh, what's going on here? No problem. Give me a moment. Now fill up. Fill up by your side. Forty-one years. Yeah. Yeah. And Mr. James, if you face any problem, then notify me, okay? I'm here to help you out for that. Uh, okay, what was your name again? Uh, my name is Alan Marshall. I just told you before okay. when I was giving you the number. And this kind of fraudulent things just happen when you go online. Through online, they just try to do these kinds of illegal scams with the help of your information, sir. Oh. And you don't know about that because you are a normal user of a computer. That's why you don't know these kinds of things which is going on. Because 55% of customers of our Amazon is facing this kind of issues which they are having right now, sir. So. Uh, oh, you need to write down the cancellation amount, sir. So. Oh, the amount, uh, 390 yeah. yeah, so, I don't know why that, I must have missed that, uh, paste. No uh, problem, no problem. 399. Do you need to put the symbol? Ninety-nine. Yeah, put the decimal over there. Put a dot. Yeah, correct.
Uh, are you sure? Yeah, I definitely want to cancel. Um, yes, exactly. The refund. Yes. Uh, mm -hmm. Submit. Okay. And after that, what do you see on your screen? Just notify me. Uh, cancellation form by Amazon.com refund. Uh, refund link has been sent to your checking account statement. Please log into your account. Yeah, exactly. To accept. Oh, shoot. Yes, okay. you need to accept the link from your statement where you just received from our Amazon financial team. Now you just normally go ahead and check that. So from your end. Okay. Yeah. And once you just see the refund link, notify that Alan, I just got the fund from Amazon. Okay, you just okay. need to notify me. So, okay, ah, okay. Bye, Brandon. Brandon. Fifty above. Now, can you just confirm me, Mr. James? Did you receive the fund from Amazon? The link, which you can see, confirm me that. Uh, no. You haven't got that fund from Amazon. All right, sir. So it might can be happen. There is a mistake, like there is a technical issue which we are facing right now. What I'm going to do, simply I will transfer this call to my financial manager, our head manager. He is going to speaking with you in just a couple of minutes. Just stay on the line for some seconds. So I need to transfer this call to my manager, okay? Okay. All right, I appreciate for that, sir. Just stay on the line, be with me. I really appreciate for that. Yeah, okay, thank you. Uh, I'm kindly, I know you don't touch your computer, so please. Okay, James, yeah, okay. Uh, I appreciate for that. Hello? James? Uh, yeah, very good afternoon. Uh, good afternoon, sir. This is Brandon, one of the refund officer. How are you doing today? Uh, yeah, I'm okay, Brandon, thank you. How are you? I'm doing good, sir. Thank you so much for asking that. Now, you were just having a word to one of my representatives where he was trying to help you to get the money refunded back to you, right? That was in charge. Yeah. So, now, could you just confirm me the refund amount that was in charge? Uh, 399.99. That's right. So, to, for regarding that amount, sir, you do not have to wait for any business days or any business hours. Uh, first of all, we need to do one thing, the fraudulent charge that happened up. We're going to go ahead and make that secure for you so that you make sure that in future you will not face that problem again. Anymore, okay. okay. Uh, so I would like you to go ahead and please select your checking account where you want the funds to be refunded back. <laughs> See, it's not there. I thought, you know. no. Okay. okay. Now, now, you see over there, uh, it shows you your available balance, what you have, right, sir? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Now, whatever the available balance you see, please make sure that you do not read that to me over the phone. I want you to write down the balance in a piece of a paper. So okay. once the funds are transferred to you from us, so that is how you will be sure that you have successfully received the money. Okay. Uh, right, let me just grab a piece of paper. Uh, yeah. Once you have it, you can let me know. Yeah, I've done it. Yeah, I did. That's what I've just said. I'm, I'm done. Okay. So I will be going ahead and making the transaction start. Okay. Okay. So what happens? So the transaction we will go in and make that submitted for you. So for that amount, you do not have to wait for any business days or any business hours. Okay, so that's where the transaction will be submitted instantly for you. So that's how the work will be uh, submitted. Okay. 
Do you still see your uh, regular desktop screen, sir? Yeah. Okay, give me one second. Because we need to, first of all, make the connection secure so that we will make sure with the transaction we will be uh, placing up, okay? So okay. it will be connected on a secure network. So give me just a moment. Now, if you could just go ahead and grab a piece of a paper and a pen, I'll be giving you some transaction details so you can write that down. Uh, okay. In the meantime, and you can see that on your screen, our department technician they are working on to get that initiated. Okay. okay. So once the connection on the path gets secured, okay. I would like you know that. It's very loud in the background. I can hardly hear. All right. Okay, I'll go ahead and try to work on the connection so she will be very loud. Okay, give me just a minute. Let me work on the connection for you. And sir, could you please verify me the Amazon account that you use? Like, are you the only person that uses the account or apart from you, somebody else as well? Uh, no, I only use the Amazon account, my Amazon account, anyway. Okay. So, so regarding this uh, problem that initiated with, like, you remember you shared your Amazon password with anybody? No, um, I changed my password a few months ago because i thought someone was well my son was messing about with my with my phone and i thought he'd ordered something but so i had to change my password oh okay so for that what will happen so you could do one thing we will go ahead and put the additional security on the on your amazon account so after it has been taken care okay, okay. after 24 hours i would request you to change your amazon password okay Okay. So that will add uh, more security to it. Okay. So give me just a second up here. Now regarding the uh, connection thing, okay, uh, that you do hear a lot of background noises, right? So yeah. So let me just work on that for you so that you could hear me better, okay? Give okay. me just a moment. All right, so now for the security reason, if you would see a work securely or a black screen on your computer, you can let me know, okay? Okay. All right, now what do you see at the moment, sir? I uh, see a black screen. Okay, black screen means that you are connected on a secure network, okay? So I'll just go ahead and update the security patch up over here. So we can go ahead and submit the transaction, okay? okay? So now once you will see your screen back to you, just do let me know, all right? Yeah. And now tell me one thing, sir. Now you, you, you got a piece of a paper and a pen ready with you at the moment, right? Yeah, yeah. So I'll be providing you my name, my phone numbers, and some of the following details. So if in future, whenever you need any help, you could directly give us a call for any further helps, okay? Okay. So write down my name. Start with my first name, Brandon. Uh, Brandon, B-A-R-A-N-D-O-N. B-R-A-N-D-O-N, right. Yeah. My last name is Jacob. J-A-C-A-B. J-A-C-O-B. O-B, oh, Jacob, okay. My employee ID, you can also make a note of my employee ID. Okay. That is J as in Jacob, B as in boy, 786. 786. Right. And the amount that my representative confirmed that was 399.99, right? Yeah. 399.99. Okay. Okay. And please make a note of my phone number. Okay. That is two, two zero six. Two zero six. 
I'm just giving you a transaction number. You can please write down the transaction number. Trans ID, okay. Start with number eight, number eight, number eight, three times eight. Eight, eight, eight. D as in Daniel. Uh, D. C as in Charlie. C. A as an apple. A. C for Charlie. C. Number four. Number four. You like umbrella. A U. Then give a hyphen. A uh, hyphen. Then zero zero. Zero zero. Seven nine three two. Seven nine three two. Okay. Now just read it back so I'll make sure you got it right. Uh eight 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 D C A C four U hyphen zero zero seven nine three two. That's right. Now, very shortly, sir. Now you will see your screen back to you with the security page from our Amazon refund server so if you see anything on your screen like that just let me know okay okay just a moment okay i have my yeah i see No problem, sir. Thank you. Give me just a moment. Now, the last thing that we need to work on, that will be your refund amount, okay, which is three ninety nine ninety nine, okay? Okay. So before you type the number, please listen to my instructions very carefully. Right now, I'm going to go ahead and start the transfer. When the transfer will start, you will see that this box will move with a bunch of numbers and alphabet. While the time this will be moving with numbers and alphabet, you need to type your refund amount three ninety nine ninety nine, and and after that, you need to press on enter. That part of the money will be transferred to you. All right. Uh, okay. Uh, so just type it here now. Not now, okay? When you see the box moving, then you have to type in the numbers when you find it moving. Uh, okay. Now you see the box is moving. The transfers has started, okay, sir? So you need to go ahead and type your refund amount right now. Type uh, 399. Just, just type it here, yeah? Now? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just uh, punch it from your keyboard. And now, once you're done, just press enter. Okay, 399 dot nine nine and enter okay yeah, press and yes yeah i have to press enter all right sir so i just got the confirmation that the transfer has been completed okay okay you see that at the bottom it says money successfully transferred yeah. So now we need to just check through your statement whether the three ninety nine ninety nine got transferred to you from Amazon or not. Okay. So please have a look on your screen, sir. Uh, no, 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 no. That says thirty nine thousand nine hundred ninety nine. Oh that's that, that says thirty nine thousand nine hundred ninety nine. Give me a second. Let me just check. Oh, you see over here on the transaction system. Oh. I think what happened to the you see the the disable period is missing. I think when you were typing in the numbers, 
you miss out the decibel period. And because of that, what happened instead of 399.99, what happened 39,999 got transferred to you. Oh my God. I missed the de- I'm sure I pressed the decimal point. That's the dot, isn't it? The dot's yes. the decimal point. I, oh, yes, yes. Oh, I understand. Sh- I think that was the reason why your checking account is over $39,000 extra with that amount. Tell me one thing, this error or the mistake that happened, did you do that on purpose or it happened accidentally? No, of course I didn't do it on purpose. No, I pressed 399.99. I might have pressed, so I might have, oh. or, or like maybe oh. through your keyboard, it did not took the disable dot or you might not press the dot that hard. Okay. Yeah. Well, so my son, not... my son was press, messing about with my computer yesterday. So, uh, I know he spilled Coke on the, on the computer. Um, mm-hmm. and I had, I had to get some cleaning liquids and stuff to try and clean it. So I don't know whether maybe it's a sticky key or something. Oh, okay, shit. so what I'm going to do, I'm going to ask the department to go ahead and cancel this transfer then. Okay, yeah, thank you, um, uh, Brandon. Oh, man, oh, 300, 3,000, 39,000. Um, cancel this due to wrong amount. Do you see over there what I mentioned? Yeah, uh, need to cancel this transfer, yeah, okay. keyboard mistake yeah or keyboard error or something might have been yeah i just mentioned over there that it was a keyboard mistake so what will happen the company will not take any legal investigation either under your name or my name so we will be in trouble anything like that okay all right yeah give me one second uh our so right now you would find a security scan on your computer at the moment okay so when the security scan will be going on, I would request you not to type anything from your keyboard, okay? Okay. This means that the finance department, they they are working on the transfer to get it canceled. Okay. Yeah, hopefully, yeah, okay. So, okay, oh yeah. So give me just a moment. Let me go and try to get this uh, taken care of, okay? Give yeah. Me just a moment. Okay, yeah. Mm, damn. Stupid freaking keyboard. Now you see the security scan going on? Yeah, I don't have to type anything in here, do I? That's right. What? What? So they are working on this to get it cancelled, so oh. once the box is dropped, it will let us know whether the transfer got cancelled or not. Okay. Okay. Uh, account is oh sh- account is blocked. Unable to uh, cancel. Account is blocked. Oh, what what account? My account's blocked. Give me one second. Let me just check on the. Uh, status that we just receive at the moment okay okay we just, we just re- oh man all right so right now we just tried to go ahead and cancel this transfer but actually what happened uh due to the wrong amount that was submitted transfer because of that what happened our account system got and due to that, I'm sorry I can't hear what you're saying your line is breaking up or stop it from other side. your line is breaking up I can't hear what you're saying. Give me one second. It's breaking up. Hold no, on. That, that's that's moment. that's better. That's better. You were like like R two D two or something out of Star Wars. It was like breaking up, and I couldn't like you. I was like hearing every other word. <sighs> oh, okay. So actually, what happened right now? We just try to cancel this transfer, but because of the wrong amount that was submitted in. What happened? Our bank account got blocked, and because of that, we were unable to cancel the transaction or stop the transaction that happened. So, so what we have to do right now, the extra money that got transferred to you, you have to keep your refund amount with you, and the remaining which is extra, you need to return that back to us. Okay, um, okay how am I going to do that? Uh... Give me just 
Can we do a bank transfer? Yes, yes. That will be through a bank transfer. What the details that will be required? Give me a second. First, I need to speak with my manager on this. Okay. Okay. Exactly. Can we just do just do a direct transfer from? Can we do a direct transfer from? Yeah, here? yeah. No, no. Give me one second. Just leave your mouse for a second. Okay. Just leave your mouse. Oh, uh, hold on a minute. Let me just minimize your bank page for a moment here. Okay. Now, if you would, if you uh, first, we need to just uh, take care of this, okay, so that neither you or the company will be having any problems or difficulties. So, if you would just see a black screen on your computer again, let me know. Uh, yeah, it's gone black again. Okay, so give, please allow me a moment. Let us go ahead and try to. So, I'm just going to put you on hold for a minute, then I'm going to be right back to you, all right, sir? Okay. Just bear with me. Thank you. Oh my god. Buddy. Thirty nine thousand. Shit. Yeah, hello. Where are you, sir? I hello. 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 Yes. You hear me? Can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you, hello? yeah. Yeah, what happened? What do you mean? This is Peter. Who are you? What's your name and what's your what do you for a living? Uh, what, what my name's Hello. Hello, yeah. Can you hear me, Peter? What do you for a living? What do you for a living? What do I do for a living? I'm a I'm a mechanic. I work on on buses and cars and stuff. <laughs> what do you mean? Okay. Just, just hold me on the line. Yeah, now, you, now you're starting to scare me now. What's going on? Hello, Peter? Hello? What the hell is going on? Yeah, hello? Yeah. Hello? What do you do for a living? I'm a mechanic. Yes, Are you just... Is, is this... Living. I'm you are the mechanic. I'm a mechanic, yeah. I've just told you that. How much salary you have? What? How much salary do you have? How much salary what? Monthly income. You... How much? Sorry? How much what? What do you mean, how much salary? Just give me a second. What? What do you mean? Yeah, hello. Yeah, hello. Oh my god, you listen, you you're confusing me now. Oh, he hung up. He hung up. I heard him say a hacker. A hacker. Let's see if they still black my screen out, yeah. Let's call them back. They're not gonna answer. Hello? Yeah, what happened? Yeah, yeah what happened? The line went dead. What happened? Did you hang up on me or something? We we know who are you. Understand? What does that mean? You what? What does that mean? What is are what? Are you in front of your computer? Yeah, I can see a black bloody screen still. You see the black glory screen, right? You just be on the line. In a few minutes, I will talk to you, okay? Okay, uh, listen, what the hell is minutes. going on? I don't understand what's going on. I, I, okay, okay, just, just give me a second. Oh my freaking God. Could my day get any worse? Hello. Thank Hello. Thank you for calling Dominos. This is Dominos. What do you want? Calling who? Hello. Hello. This is Dominos. What do you want? Uh, what do you, you mean? Me what do I want? Dominos. This is. This is for the bank. 
from Domino's. What happened to you? What you mean? What you Peter? Yeah, Peter. I've just been on the phone. I've just on the phone to you before, and you said that you were going to speak to me. Oh, wrong number. Is that wrong number? What you mean wrong number? You phoned me before. You were on the yeah. phone to me. No, no, no. It's a wrong number. It's a Domino's. Me teri bapo. Okay. Me teri bapo. Me teri bapo. Me teri bapo. You know Hindi, you motherfucker. Yeah, Punjabi Mundar. Terry Market Chut Posri ke banchu. Punjabi Mundar. Terry Market Chut Bosri wala banchu. Bosri wala. He no like it. You know, you know Hindi. Everybody get your fucking hands up.